Because I, I was still living with my mother and father. <laughs> like, you know. I, while I, you were shooting the wire? While I was shooting the wire. I was still living in my mother and father's basement. Wow. Yeah, until I, I, I didn't move out of my mom and dad's house until I got married. Um, until I got married. How long you been married? Man, I'm I'm going on 18 years of marriage. 18? Yeah. That's another thing I want to ask you, dog. 18 years of marriage. No, I'm going on 19 years of marriage. We've been married for 18. You think it was in the beginning? I know right now you got a hold of thing, but in the beginning, mm -hmm. was it a huge challenge being married? Yeah. When you in the entertainment industry? Yeah, most definitely. Yeah, I mean, I would be lying if I said it wasn't a huge challenge. Um, in the beginning, you know, me and my wife got married in 2004. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you were still doing the wire. Yeah, I was still doing the Oh, then uh, you hot. <laughs> I was still doing the wire. Um, you know, just the challenges of being young. Because mm. I got I, we got married, I got married young. Right. You know, so just the challenges of being young and um being on a hot show and the women, you know, constantly coming at you. And just just different. Just different obstacles, period. But but it was never, it was never no disrespect mm. to my wife. Right. You know what I'm saying? It was never none of that. But you know, coming up, it was it was a, it was it was certain things in our marriage that had to get checked. Like what? You know, I mean, just the way my approach might have been, my response might have been to women might that, that may have been coming at me. Yeah. <laughs> My response might have been a little too friendly, you know right, what I'm saying? Right, and right. then wifey like, well, that's not, you know, the, you know. I mean, just, just, just being in the industry alone, period. Because you know, nowadays, man, and you, you can speak on this, man. Some women don't, they don't really care if you marry. Mm -hmm. It's almost like if you got a ring on your finger, some women like, hey, I right, bet. Yeah. That mean I don't got really. Whatever we could do our thing, and then you go in, go and go back home to wifey. <laughs> they got all the chicks, all the married dude. Oh, I can't man. get a girlfriend because all the married men got them. They like, yeah. why you single, Rico? Yeah. <laughs> I ain't married. Yeah, as exactly. soon as I get married, exactly. I'm gonna have a team. It seems like that. That's what it seemed like. It seemed like the married men are the ones that got it the, the most difficult. Bro, it's, it's, it's difficult. But 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 you know what, man? Like I said, man, been been married for 18 years to my wife. Aisha Cheney, it, it's um, it's it, it's a blessing, you know. Why I was just thinking about that uh, today, you know, watching each other mature even more. We we, we getting older, mm. so changes happen as you get older because we right. ain't getting no younger, but still being able to, you know, maintain our responsibilities, um, still be in love, still, you know what I'm saying, still do everything together, mm. um. Watching our son, man, is is getting ready to to graduate from high school next year. It's like a bit, though. It's, wow, you know, I mean, just, but just the family in in itself, like me and my wife, it, it's like that union that we established back in two thousand four when we said I do mm. to 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 eighteen to what a twenty something years later, eighteen years of marriage. But it's you know it, it's 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 great, man. It, it's a it's a beautiful thing, and I'm. I'm happy, you know what I'm saying? I'm happy, she happy, she don't never gotta lift a finger a day in her life, I've, mm -hmm. I've already established that. You know what I'm saying? So it's 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 love. That's dope, man. Cause man, it would have been hard for me to shoot that scene when Avon came home. <laughs> yeah. And I had like, man, it was a very comfortable situation going on up yeah. and yeah. It was a vibe, man, like, yeah. what? And then the uh man, what's the guy name? He had got out of jail. He was an old hit man, but he wanted to, he he opened the boxing gym. What's his name, man? Chad Ma Comey. Um, man, amazing. Yeah, actor. Cut, yeah. Cuddy. Cuddy, yeah. Man, them scenes when like y'all put Cuddy on and like I was like, bro, <laughs> I know they was in there cutting up. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, for sure, man. But you know what? Being actors and artists in this industry and, and maintaining um, a level of professionalism mm. on set. We, you know, we know because you know. I mean, even with 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 women being on set, whether they have dress, whether they naked, or you still gotta you gotta kind of like take that approach. Like, okay, are you comfortable with this? Everybody right. has to be comfortable, so nobody 
gets uncomfortable mm. and then it get it could get ugly if, if if one of them ladies or even a man if, if somebody get uncomfortable it could be like all right we it's a whole nother issue yeah you know so i think with with any you know like love scenes in in, in television films you could just see the level of com of, of of comfort hey it's your favorite cousin at the cookout rico ramil check out my brand new book get rich and praise god man on amazon.com right now everything you need to learn how to secure that bag like a boss is right here in this book man i went from sleeping in the 1984 build Le sable to living full time off the gifts i was born with and i want to show you how to do the same thing man get rich and praise god man on amazon.com right now check, check, check runners, runners. Check, 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 check